today, a shark ends up washing up on a South Florida shore. Seven's Tavares Jones is live in Pompano Beach where it was found, Tavares. Lorena, you know, photos and videos worth a thousand words for beachgoers here in Pompano Beach this morning as they came to find an 11 foot hammerhead shark on the shore left for dead. Um, so we saw a posting on Facebook and um, saying that there was um, a shark that was found dead on the beach. It's quite the big fish tail circulating on Pompano Beach after a hammerhead shark was found on shore by beachgoers Wednesday morning. See, because I've never seen a shark up that close live. Joan Florenzano showed up to see the site firsthand and she was not the only one. And everybody was just like taking pictures with her. The female shark pregnant with some 24 babies. Not only did she not survive, but none of her babies survived, which is terribly sad. While this onshore spectacle is getting quite the attention, several questions still remain as to who caught the shark and why it was not released back into the water. Joan says she could see a hook in the shark's mouth. Um, it looked like it was like about this big. It was, you know, really large in her mouth. The shark later buried as Florida Fish and Wildlife continued their investigation. Meanwhile, this is a fish tale many plan to share for years to come. Now, back out here live, as I said, several questions remain as to who actually captured this shark and left it for dead on the shoreline. Marine biologists out here on the beach today say the shark spanning 11 foot was just before adulthood. Again, those 24 baby sharks did not survive. For now, live here in Pompano Beach this noon, Tavares Jones, 7 News.